The Chevy Volt is one of the most anticipated vehicles in General Motors' 100-year history. An electric car that can travel 40 miles without using a drop of gasoline and be recharged using a standard household electrical outlet. With an anticipated price range of $30,000 to $40,000, it's not what you'll spend, but what you'll save. According to Chevy, the average city driver can expect to get a jaw-dropping 230 miles per gallon. Before the Volt goes into mass production at GM's Hamtramck assembly plant in Detroit, pre-production models are handmade at GM's pre-production operations facility in Warren. This process ensures that what's designed on paper operates efficiently on the road. These will be what we use for the next year to actually complete all the development activities on performance, crash worthiness, life, durability. Without these vehicles, we really couldn't finish that job. It also provides the basis for building the car efficiently on GM's mass assembly line. Warren, Michigan. This is the site of GM's 200,000 square foot factory, which builds the pre-production volts. A place where raw metal and designer's dreams are transformed into finely honed vehicles. A place of closely guarded trade secrets, the fear industrial espionage. This is where every new GM model begins its life. Here, old-fashioned craftsmanship and high-tech machines coexist. Any surprises must be worked out during the pre-production process, not during mass production, where a mistake would be extremely costly to correct. So the pressure is on workers to spot every possible problem and bring it to the attention of engineers. The Volt program was started with the idea that it would have to be done quickly because it's trying to get into a place in the market that really isn't filled today. Does that put extra pressure on the program? Absolutely. Do we have all the answers to every one of these things as we stand here today? No. Despite these concerns, our cameras were allowed unprecedented access to this new electric vehicle in the making.